Cars 2, also known as Cars 2, the video game, is an action racing game developed by Avalanche Software. It is based on the film Cars 2, the sequel to the 2006 film Cars. Originally announced at E3 2011, the game was released by Disney Interactive on major platforms in North America on June 21, 2011, and in Australia two days later. The game was released in Europe on July 22, 2011. The PlayStation 3 version of the game was reported to feature stereoscopic 3D gameplay. A Nintendo 3DS version was released on November 1, 2011, the same day the film was released on DVD and Blu-ray. A PlayStation Portable version was released in North America on November 8, 2011. It was also released in Europe on November 4, 2011. It was the last Pixar game to be released for the PlayStation Portable. Unveiled at the American International Toy Fair in New York City, Cars 2 allows players to jump into the Cars universe with a brand new international spy theme. The game features an array of Cars characters competing in action-packed spy adventures, as well as world-class racing. The game received mixed to positive reviews, with a score of 72 on Metacritic for the Xbox 360 version. All the main actors from the film reprised their roles in the game except for Owen Wilson, Barbara Kottmeyer and Michael Caine, who were replaced by Keith Ferguson, Josara Gennaro and Martin Jarvis, respectively. The Xbox 360 version of the game became backwards compatible with the Xbox One on March 11, 2017, and the PlayStation 3 version came to the PlayStation Now game streaming service to play on PlayStation 4, PlayStation Vita, PC, and PlayStation 3 itself. Gameplay In Cars 2, a third-person racing game, players have a choice of 25 different characters and train to become world-class spies. As part of training, players participate in missions using high-tech gadgets, for example, to avoid enemies or slow them down. The game has three types of trophies, bronze, silver and gold. Points are awarded at different values depending on what type of vehicle class players use. The game characters are divided into three weight classes, heavy, medium and light. Players can unlock new cars, tracks and missions by collecting emblems. Drop-in, drop-out multiplayer modes support up to four players simultaneously. Topic. Synopsis Based on Pixar's computer animated film, Cars 2, the video game follows the exploits of car characters Lightning McQueen and Motter as they train in a secret facility known as Chrome, short for Command Headquarters for Recon Operations and Motorized Espionage. They are joined by British intelligence agents Finn McMissile and Holly Shiftwell as they attempt to become the car equivalent of spies. Several characters from the Cars 2 film appear, with additional characters from the first film and Cars 2's animated shorts available as downloadable content. Carrot a free downloadable content Carrot B paid downloadable content Carrot CDS and PSP only. Topic. Development The game was first shown to the public at E3 2011. It was also unveiled at the American International Toy Fair in New York City. According to a video interview on Game Line, John Day, the producer of the game, said they wanted to create a good family racing game and add a few things that perhaps no one has seen before. Avalanche Software was working in close collaboration with Pixar artists to bring the humor and personality of the feature film to life. Reception. Cars 2 received mixed to positive reviews from critics, with a score of 72 and 74 on Metacritic for the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 versions respectively. IGN gave the game an 8 out of 10 rating, stating that, Cars 2 is a great multiplayer game that rivals Mario Kart. The official Xbox magazine gave it a 7.5 out of 10 rating. Praising fun and polished racing but criticizing the fact that online play was missing from the title. Game Informer gave the title a 7.75 out of 10 rating, calling it a satisfying racing experience. GameSpot's Justin Calvert gave it a 7.5 out of 10 rating, praising its career mode and track designs. 
He was, however, upset that there was no online mode as expected and also no free roam unlike its predecessors. <laughs>